Good morning. I wanted to follow up on my post from this morning that reads, addiction and intimacy do not coexist, don't coexist. Here it is. I'll make sure I get that in the screen uh, fully. What I mean by that is if your husband or wife is an addict or an alcoholic, their relationship is with their drugs and alcohol. It's not with you. They can't go out to dinner with you and sit across the table and be genuinely interested in what you have to say or how you're feeling or have that connection that's so necessary for, for us human beings because their connection is with their drugs and alcohol. You know, I know that when I was using, I, would, I, I could not sit with somebody um, and hear them and be present for them because my mind was focused on where am I going to get my, my next drug from, uh, you know, and I was a big doctor shopper that, would, that required a lot of time and money and it was very consuming. Um, you know, it also then, you know, there's the component, at least for me, of anxiety attacks where I would see the phone ring and I could see on the phone that it was somebody who I ordinarily would be very close to and could say anything to, my sister or a best friend or something. But because of the drugs and alcohol, I have so much anxiety, I can't even pick up the phone to talk to them. That's, that's what it does to me. So there's no intimacy there either. You know, imagine that, uh, you know, as a you know, young parent, as I was a young parent, but imagine as a young parent having young kids, uh, you're, and you're sitting with your kids, you're trying to play with your kids, you're trying to get your attention. That's just impossible if you're addicted to drugs and alcohol. Your mind is solely focused on where am I going to get my next drug? Where am I going to get my next drink? The fact that your, your son or your daughter is trying to tell you, look at this toy, listen to what means a lot to me, it's just not possible. And the only way, you're in a, it's a three-way relationship. And the only way to have that intimacy, to, to grow that relationship, is to remove that component, to remove the drugs and alcohol. Uh, this, I think, may somewhat uh, be more geared towards husband and wives who have an addicted spouse than parents that have an addicted child. But it, but but it's true of everybody, you know that uh, that uh, addiction and intimacy do not coexist in the same relationship. Just something to keep in mind. I'd love to hear what you think. Uh, as I said, I'm going to continue to try. Uh, doing these videos. I want to get better at them. I want to get more comfortable behind the camera, something I have not been. So I would welcome your comments, your feedback, uh, anything you have to say. I'd love to hear what you have to say. Anyway, have a great day and thanks for watching this. Bye-bye.